And cardiovascular disease is the number one cause of death in Europe and the U.S. To talk a little more about the dangers of cholesterol, we're joined today in the studio by Dr. Christoph Graf from the German Heart Institute. Thanks for joining us. How come Thank the you. good and the bad cholesterol can actually get out of balance? What's going wrong? What's going wrong? Actually, it's a time, I think. It's, it's the modern times. It's the way how we, how, uh, how we eat. It's a time how we, how we act, how we move. There's so much problems with having too much food and having not, in, not sufficient activity. So mm -hmm. we have a high intake, but we don't use the calories up. And that is one reason. The other reason is the stuff we eating, mm -hmm. so it's the fatty stuff, but it's also the carbohydrates. In, in the past, actually, we've always looked at the fat, saying that's the bad guy ruining your heart. You don't believe in that anymore? No, no, it's true. It's definitely true. But the other reason is we know, know now from very good studies mm -hmm. that also carbohydrate, high carbohydrate, carbohydrate intake, is is the reason for increased lipid levels. Okay. So we need both. We have to reduce fats, we have to reduce carbohydrates, and we have to be more active. But that means a diet with less pasta would be good for us. Yes, I'm, I'm sad to say yes, but, but <laughs> it's true. It seems to me as well. So we have to reduce this, yes. Okay, thanks up to here, Professor Graf. You're welcome.